Assalamu alaikum. This is your brother Riyan Arab recording for I Love You Allah Productions. I receive some phone calls and I receive emails of people complaining. People are complaining about difficulties they're going through. Difficulties such as relationship difficulties, marriage issues, um, educational issues, and all sorts of issues, you name it. And they're having difficulties with solving these problems. So then I looked into the Quran and I found the solution. The solution was in the story of Yunus alayhi salam. Yunus is a prophet of Allah. Yunus was sent hundreds and hundreds of years ago, as a matter of fact, thousands of years ago, to the people who disbelieved in him. And yet, when he went to them and conveyed the message, they remained uh, in the state of disbelief. They didn't want to believe in him. So then Yunus gave up on them, and he supplicated against them. He asked Allah to destroy them. Why? Because he has tried for years and years, and none of them want to believe. So then Yunus left. And what happened? These people then believed in Allah. After he left, the torment of Allah came down and that's when they believed in Allah. They said, indeed, there is a God. Oh Allah, bring back Yunus to us. So then what happened? Yunus has left and he got into a boat so that he can travel to another side of the earth. Then what happened? The punishment, the torment left their area and went towards Yunus while he was in the boat. Suddenly, the boat starts getting shaky and somebody on this boat has to leave. Otherwise, everybody's going to die. The boat is going to sink and everybody's going to die. So then Yunus jumped off the boat and a whale came and swallowed him by the command of Allah. When this whale swallowed him, Yunus fell into three darknesses. The darkness of the night, the darkness of the ocean, and the darkness of the stomach of the whale. So then he thought that he was dead. Allah then commanded all the fish in the sea to say subhanallah so he could know that he's alive. All the fish in the sea said subhanallah. Yunus then knew that he is alive. So then he supplicated to Allah and he said, La ilaha illa anta subhanak inni kuntu min al Glory be to you. There is no God but you. Indeed, I was of the wrongdoers. Glory be to you. He glorified Allah. Oh Allah, there is nothing better than you. I was of the wrongdoers. This is it. I was of the wrongdoers. I committed evil. I did wrong. He blamed himself. He blamed himself and that's when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala commanded the well to spit Yunus out. Yunus came back to the lands. He went back to his people and all of them were believers. Just a few days ago, everybody disbelieved in him. But then he left and came back and every single one of them believed. Subhanallah. And then this verse in the Quran, which is a solution to the people's problems who have complaints. This verse where Allah says, لولا أنه كان من المسبحين للبث في بطن الحوت إلى يوم يبعثون. Allah said, had he not been of those who glorify Allah in the beginning before this incident, then he would have stayed in the stomach of the well until the day of judgment. Subhanallah. So the lesson we receive from this is that when you worship Allah during the easy times, Allah saves you during the difficulties, during the difficulties, during the difficult times, Allah is there for you and He takes you out of those difficulties and brings you into ease. SubhanAllah, look into this verse, read it with understanding and, and you know, like put, the, apply this verse to yourself, to your life. Imagine those difficulties that you go through uh, when your wife left you or when you lost a child or something, you know, some diff when you lost your job or anything, whatever it is, something difficult. And just try to remember, how long did it take for Allah to respond to you? Allah could respond anytime. He hears the prayers. But He responds to those people who used to worship Allah before this difficulty quicker than He responds to those people who didn't used to worship Allah before this difficulty. We ask Allah to make us of those who Worship him during the times of ease so that he could be with us during the difficulties. Thank you very much for listening. Wassalamu alaikum.